Hey everybody, this is Jared Albrick, the yard sale artist. You know me as Death Probe here with another I Finished It. And this time we're going to talk about an actual real book with like, you know, words printed on pages, no pictures, no comic. <laughs> I recently, as you guys know, faithful listeners and watchers will know, I recently finished my entire watch of the Columbo television series. And it was really, really, really good. I've seen every episode of Columbo they ever made now. And I was surprised when I went to my local library book sale to find this Columbo novel. I had no idea there was additional Columbo material in novel form. And I went and picked this one up. Uh, this one's called The Hoffa Connection. It's by William Harrington. Wrote in 1995. The Columbo TV show officially finished its last episode, I want to say, in about 2001. I think 2001 was the last episode. Uh, but it was definitely winding down by 95. There was just a handful uh, of Columbos in between 95 and 2001. So what I found out is there's a whole series of these books uh, by William Harrington. And this is one of them. And so I picked it up and I decided to give it a read. So what I think of it, it was pretty good. It definitely has the spirit of Columbo. Um, two things about it kind of bothered me, but... You know, not enough to say it's a it's a bad book. It's a fine book. It's a good book. If you like Columbo and you want more Columbo material, seek out the William Harrington books. In fact, I just found another one at um, I had another library book sale just last week, and I found another one. It's over there on my on my nightstand, uh, just waiting to be read. So um, these Harrington books are pretty good. The two things that put me off about this one was this one had a lot more um, risque sexual content to it than anything we'd seen on the shows before. Um, not, not, not real. In, it's not like super erotic sexual stuff. So I don't want to scare any potential readers off. But just it had a, there was a lot more sexuality to it, and and some some things that some readers might uh, find uh, uncomfortable. But um, still done in a in a Columbo style. Like I could see how they could make this a TV episode, but it would be an edgy one. That's how I would put it. Um, the other thing that kind of just bothered me about it is the title. It's called The Hoffa Connection. And they don't, they kind of real, they kind of reveal the Hoffa Connection as sort of this big plot twist in the last few pages. And I'm like, well, we kind of all saw that coming because it's how the book is The Hoffa Connection. So I really wish they would have called it something else. So the end would have been more impactful. But aside from that, the character's written well, the mystery is good, the way Columbo goes through it, the characters are well developed. Um, they do spend a good amount of time on the killer or killers. And, uh, we'll see how that all works out, uh, much like they would in the TV show, because fans of the show know it really kind of focuses on the killer. And then Columbo just kind of shows up sometimes, you know, on a 90 minute show, he might not show up until a half hour in um, just to start pulling at the threads and sort of picking apart. Uh, the, the killer's um, process and how they did things. So if you like Columbo, I definitely would recommend checking out these William Harrington books. Like I said, a little edgier with its slightly sexual content. Not the greatest title in the world <laughs> for its plot twist at the end, but still really solid book. Uh, like I said, I just started the other one that I found at the last library book sale and things are going well. So uh, once again, 1995, The Hoffa Connection by William Harrington. And there's a series of these. I, I think there's at least, I want to say six or seven of these. There could be more. I'm only aware of about a handful of them. So anyway, that's uh, the latest I finished it. Little Columbo novels. I guess I'll catch you guys next time and I'm going to freeze.